In this Canva tutorial, I will show you three strategies for adding an image to a donut chart. The first strategy will demonstrate how to add a square image to the round center. Once you have your image, from the left hand panel, click on Elements and scroll down to Frames. Select the circular frame. Drag the image over the frame until it snaps into place. You can now adjust the size of the frame, and if you want to adjust the image within the frame, simply double click on it. Now to add the donut chart, click on Elements and scroll to the section of Charts. Under Pie Charts, select the donut chart. Clear the data. We want, if we want the chart to show 60%, then enter 60 and the difference between 60 and 100. In the Settings tab, hide the labels. And let's change the first color to a darker color just so that we have some contrast and we can see what we're working with. Now drag the frame, which is holding the picture, to the chart. If it's appearing behind the chart, right click on the frame and go to layer and bring to front. Align the frame in the center of the chart. And from here you can do some additional formatting such as pulling a color from the image as the main color of the chart. The second strategy for adding an image to a donut chart is when you have a graphic like this illustration that does not snap into a frame. You want the graphic to remain this large and the outer edge of the donut chart to be thinner. There is no way to adjust the width of a donut chart, so we're going to get around this by using a circle. Click on Elements, and under Shapes, select a circle. Change the color to white. And move it on top of the donut chart, aligned in the center of the chart. And now we can move our illustration, right click on it, click on layer, bring it to the front, into the center. And depending on your design, you may want to make the circle the same color as the background. The third strategy is to use a different kind of chart. As I mentioned, there is no way to adjust the line width of a donut chart. Let's delete this, click on Elements, and again scroll down to Charts. This time, under the Infographic Charts, click See All, and select the Progress Ring. With the chart selected, you can see in the left-hand panel, there's a place to enter our percentage of 60% and a place to adjust the line width. You can add the percentage label to the center and uncheck rounded endpoints. And just like with the donut chart, we can change the colors. Now our image can fit into the center without having to cover up part of the chart with a circle. And we can add some effects to our text by making it curved 30%. And then for the text beneath the chart, minus 30. To recap, we looked at three methods for adding an image to a donut chart. The first strategy is to add an image to a frame and then the chart. The second strategy is to layer the image on a circle and then onto the chart. And the third strategy is instead of using a donut chart, to use a progress ring where you can adjust the line width. A donut chart combined with an image can be a great way to capture your audience's attention.